But I will trust in the one true God. I therefore want to hand my daughter over to my son-in-law. Kneel down, I go. Let me have your hand. Bring your hand. I join the two of you today, husband and wife. <laughs> about us and fast honestly I am confused you know I keep wondering what that dream means don't be ridiculous it is written all over the world that even a child could read my princess it is one thing to have eyes and it's another thing to see with the eyes open your eyes and see that someone it's about trying to take what belongs to you. Bella, you are still talking in riddles. Can you? I mean, I'm not good at proverbs. A child who is not ready to fight does not ask what killed his father. And what is that supposed to mean? You see, without intelligence. It's nothing but a cosmetic foolishness. Yes, my princess. And that's an insult. I'm sorry, my princess. But I would love to take my leave now. Never lead in your own understanding. Some put their trust in child and all the gods. This is not all of you. Where is the chief meeting? My princess, the queen sends an error. I have a message from the king. So when she returns, pass it to her accordingly. Do you understand? My father, the king of this kingdom, has passed an order that every one of us must believe and worship in the new faith. And that whosoever decides to do otherwise will be thrown out of the palace. Do you understand? Yes. 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 Therefore, everything you do henceforth, you do in unison. If you want to go to the market, you want to go on errands, you go together to avoid distractions. Do you understand me? Yes. yes. Am I being understood? Yes, my yes. princess. Yes. You do right to make such order. When you put that in? Don't fight! Don't try it! 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 Don't try
Bad bracelet. Right? What? What? Mama, you now talk back at me. If you respect yourself, I will respect you. But since you decided not to respect yourself, I will not. You are still talking. Hey! 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 Princess of a great king. So where are you up to? Outing. Greetings, my prince. Greetings. Greetings, my prince. Greetings. The handsome prince of the great king of this kingdom. Mm -hmm. The heir apparent of the throne of my father, the king. Can I please oblige your honor to be my guest on this outing? Mm. My beautiful sister, I would gladly love to do that. But on the contrary, no one is in a better position to do that other than a better half. Excuse oh, me. Oh, I'm sorry. Forgive my ill manners. Okay. So where are you going? Oh, please say sorry again. Oh, okay. I am very sorry, my princess. You can have a smile and be smart. <laughs> better. <laughs> so where are you going? Really? Did mm -hmm. you just ask that? Of course I did. A few seconds ago, you said that you are not in a position to be my company on this quest. That it is the position of my better half. So right now, I think it's the still in position of my better half to ask me this question. Watch yeah. out! <laughs> All right, go say. I love you. I love you too, bro. You know, that's my beautiful sister, you know. Some alcohol. 
Let's go inside. Princess of the land can grant, grant me an uh, audience to listen to my humble plea. Speak. But I do not have enough time, so make it snappy. Mm, my princess, I prefer it private. Thank you. You may speak now. What is it? My princess, I I wish you can see and recognize and also take possession of the jewel I have preserved, protected and kept for you. Listen. I do not have enough time for this your rhetorical and preverbal expressions. If you have anything meaningful to say, Say it now, else. Um, I'm, I'm sorry, my princess. Rain forever, my princess. of Omaro Kingdom a whole day to go for an outing. Well, I was thinking, who delegated my elder brother into being my personal timekeeper? Because the last time I checked, Masi, the princess of Umaru Kingdom, is an adult. Who keeps her time, who does whatever she wants with her time? until her better half surfaces. Oh, 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 I know what this is about. So this is about the better half, right? Mm, you know this. <gasps> until I get a proper apology. It's the better half to you. I'll do that to you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, my God. Uh, my friends, <laughs> I am sure that the princess is not vibrant young man. From the look of things, you seem to be a hunter. Yes, absolutely. I am a hunter. Um, only a brave man will catch such a large bushmeat. Thank you. Thank you for the compliment. Can you give me? It belongs to our mother. Okay, if you say so. I beg to take my leave now.
Ago, I still can't find some anything meaningful from all you said the other time. Can you please be more explicit? Guilty is in the eyes of the behold. <laughs> Meaning? My princess, I, I am yet to describe the picture of your beauty in my head. Hmm. Abu, I would prefer you flatter me than mess with Princess Uma, the beautiful daughter of Ozurumba, the great princess of Umaru Kingdom. Because it will not be funny if this is a ploy of your mission to tell me your feelings right in my face. Death would have been preferred to life if I ever thought of such a princess. Mother, mother, guess what? Something happened today. And what is it? I hope it's something good. Of course it's something good. <laughs> Please, I can't wait to hear it. <clears throat> well, I went out today, as you can see, and uh, on my way back. I met someone that said a lot of things to me that I took as an insult. Are you two I met? A youth. I want to say. Ah, he said a whole lot of things. That I presume to be an insult, but it wasn't, brother. He was seeking for my hand in love. My marriage? Yes, mother. <laughs> yes, he was. And guess what? He gifted me with this, 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 this. I need to go. Yes, yes. <laughs> I'm so excited. So, on our way back on the outing, we met him. What can you say about what happened on our way to the stream yesterday with the princess? Hmm. Gide, my dear. They say sin is believing. The whole continent of our dear and amiable princess changed completely and became more amiable, Jovia. I can't believe that. Honestly, it's not funny. I'm floating. Feel me in peace. Floating? Yes. Keep floating. <laughs> Keep floating, my dear. <laughs> All right. Just be floating that way. Hey, go like that. Yeah. Keep floating. <laughs> you know what? She like gossip. Uh, a lot. <laughs> I think we should um, continue what we're doing inside. Greetings, Father. Greetings. You are not looking bad. <laughs> Thank you very much, Father. Father Igwe Ojike of Mbake Kingdom asked me to inform you that he and his son, Prince Ubigwe, will be paying you an impromptu visit in the next seven days. <laughs> this is great. He did? Yes, Father. Oh, wow. Well, <laughs> GK. That's good of him. So, son. Father. Were you able to fathom out in your mind any reason for his visit? Our Father, I could not preempt the mind of the king, but I believe when you see him, you'll be able to find out what his reasons are. Uh, yeah, son, I know very well that there is no smoke without fire. Mana, it is equally said that a fool who a fool society. <laughs> Father, you're right. Yes. You know that there's also a saying that he who is with Fufu, Utara, yes. he would 
desperately looks for him in his own soup. So, yeah. Father, we don't need to stress our you friends. You are the son of your father. <laughs> Thank you very much, Father. Son, it is well with you. Thank you, Father. My princess, I'm glad you're beginning to see everything I've been telling you. My princess. Okay. It's okay. Ah, you are such a genius. But how were you able to figure it out? An empty head is nothing but a load to the neck, my princess. Oh, the last time I checked, this head is not an empty head. <laughs> you know, I'm still wondering if it's possible for you to make a single sentence without using a proverb. How can I, my princess? Hmm. Anyway, thank you so much, my sister, for the eye opening. You're welcome, my princess. Okay, let me serve you. Oh, I remember. So, you are talking of giving you the opportunity of using the medals to present a sort of dance and our warriors to contest on wrestling as part of entertainment to the visiting king of Umike Kingdom, right? Father, you are oh, right. wonderful. <laughs> You are wonderful. Hi! You don't know what you have just done. You have lifted the body of my wild thought on how to entertain my friend and king, Ojike of Mbike Kingdom. Father. The great prince of Umaro, Ubike Kingdom. Father. The MP of the medals of Umaro. The pride of Umaru Kingdom. Son, I am proud of you. Thank you very much, Your Majesty. You are blessed. Man, I am so happy. Son, I give you my support. Do whatever, however, you will do it to get a positive result. Eh? My own son! Father. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Thank you, Father. My son, remember that whatever is worth doing, is worth doing well. Your Majesty, you can count on me. I trust you. Give me the best. Guys! Now to Ichi and the Chiokoro's house. The two great power tapas of Umaru will make a kingdom. Tell them that I want to see them right now, here, on emergency. Have you heard me? Yes, you Majesty. And from there, go to Onobu's house and to the chief priests. Tell them to report themselves here. The next person I will see at the gate here now should be there. Have you heard? Yes, you are now. Go, 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 go immediately. Go. So, I shall be well with you. May your days be long, Father. Oh no. Your Majesty. I have the gods. My king. As an Adara, please hear Kaaborio. Hebu Parase. That there is always a head for which a cap is made. I'm going to say for a while. If conferring is not done with the right person, it must be remedied. I'm going to say what the key is. I'm going to say what the key is. It is said that respect is reciprocal. 
Ubuna Quere, Unyana Quere. Honor should be given to whosoever it is due. Your Majesty, you speak like the mystics. Are there things you're supposed to know which you don't? That's my thing. Because I am beginning to think that the God has fooled me to come before His Majesty. For I know that an invited king has a clear heart and mind for his host. I have the gods. Woe be thou I, if I should invite Calipas of your type in my community only to fool them around. Mm -mm. Anakari, Anakari. Your Majesty, patience will be lost, waiting in vain to grasp a little meaning from the enormous volume of your wise saying, our king. Yes, my king. Because a child is taken for fool when he fails to understand a language. But a man, an adult, what shall he be taken for? when he is unable to understand the language of his king. I of the gods, as my people say, that whosoever a proverb is meant to, and the explanation of the proverb also led to him or her, that the dowry on his mother mm. is a waste. Now listen. To cut the long story short, honor should be given to whom it is due because respect is reciprocal. My king, I beg you to leave, for I am tired of your rhetoric expressions without a rival. And listen to the king. And a king should be strict to time. With the message I want to pass to you, Iwe Ojike, the king of Mbike Kingdom, will be paying us a solidarity royal visit on less than four days from now. I would want you to pray your own way. To His intention for the mission is a genuine one, my king. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. Really, I equally saw it my own way. No. Your Majesty. Make sure you instruct all segments. Let all hands be on deck. Let everybody, every segment, continue with their preparation as it is planned. Your Majesty, everything must be done according to the plans. <laughs> exactly. But then, that is not enough reason for my feeling from you. Oh. Yeah. Thank you for your understanding. So, what do I do this time? Um, you know, I've always wanted you to do a favor for me. My brother, the prince of this kingdom, is having a challenge trying to convince the woman of his choice. Oh. So I need you to come into the picture. Okay. I would want you to talk to her and at least try to convince her. That's a small thing, no? I I'm know you will be of great help. Anything for you, my princess. Well, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much. Thank so, you. um, mm -hmm. let me know. 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 
Madam, are you passing or you're stopping? Hello. Good afternoon. Yes, good afternoon. Um, my name is Flora, the only daughter of uh, James Murphy, CEO Murphy Holdings. I know your name. Hey, you know me just like that. You just came down and saw me on the road. You're asking, What is my name? Anyway, I don't do like that. I don't just see people on the road and tell them my name. I'm sorry. Hello. Hello. My prince, I, <clears throat> I have always known you as an understanding person. Yes. And that is why I have decided to confide in you. <laughs> but if I may ask, would my prince give me a go ahead? Okay, go ahead, I'm all yes. Thank you. Our people say that it is only a ripe fruit that attracts stones. But the right stone will bring it down when placed on target. That's right. My prince, I love your sister, Ma. And it is my wish to make her my bride. Is that all? You have my consent. Go ahead and talk to her. Really? Yes. Thank you, my prince. After all, you're a good man. Yes. So, your feet for her. Thank you, my prince. Mm -hmm. Live long. No problem. Let's take my leave now. Yeah, who is there? Me. Who are you? Me. Greetings. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you. There is Princess Mara. Princess Mara. She's a... Thank you. You're welcome. Hey, you oh. are not 
Greetings, my princess. Uh, greetings. Can my humility be accorded any respect, no matter how little? Can my princess, Uma, who grant me even a minute's privacy? <clears throat> Excuse me. Precious to me than gold. And I am about to prove it. Mm -hmm. How do you mean? I'm about to ask for your hand in marriage officially. In two days, I shall come with my people. Oh my, oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, this is incredible. No. Oh my god. to you that you have a sister like me and um, Asha? Of course, yes. I mean, but why? <clears throat> have you ever for once wondered, imagined what we've been up to, where we go to, who we speak with? I mean, as our only brother and the heir apparent of our father's throne. I'm very sorry, my princess. That's just a mere oversight. Okay? Forgive me. Hmm? Well, this is ah. it. Oh, my friends. Uh, one more question. Mm. Sorry, ah. sir. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Um, do you know Agu? Agu. Agu. Agu, the great warrior, the hunter and the warrior of our land. In the great warrior. Yes, I, I know him and what, what about him? Oh, nothing serious. Just. Do you like him? Like him for what? I mean, why should I like him? Uh, Is he organizing an event? Well, why should I like him? My prince, can you just take it slowly? Calm down. I'm sorry well, about that. Well, <clears throat> I just want to tell you that. He will be visiting with his people tomorrow. What? Mm -hmm. What for? To seek for the hand of one of your sisters in marriage. What? I'm off, my friends. See you. I won't take your time. Okay, um, no problem. So please make it snappy. As you can see, we're rushing somewhere. What is it? The game of heart is not a game of chess. Rather, it's a game of snooker. 
He only puts into the right pocket. Go with my sister. What's going on? My princess, I don't really know. Who's that? Do you know? Do you I know who that is? I don't know her. Tell her to get off the road. What for that? But now what is your problem? Can't you see this car? Uh, what? Can I do it? Okay, hold on. Um, um excuse me, madam. You are. Who we have here? Princess of Umaru Kingdom. Good to see you. Who are you and why are you obstructing my path? Oh, really? Did I block your path? How come I didn't even notice it? I beg your pardon. Don't beg for my pardon because you will never have it. Until you leave what belongs to me. What are you even saying? What is in my possession that belongs to you? A child that says he does not eat chicken. But it's egg. <laughs> That's a cheap adage. Now I have understood what they meant by an empty head is a burden to the neck that bears it. Maybe I should bring to your memory that beauty without intelligence is nothing but cosmetic foolishness. A child who is not ready to fight should not ask of what killed the father. Leave my man alone. I am warning you. Else, <laughs> there is nothing you can do. Get into your car and then get off the way. Rubbish. Just imagine. Have you seen this person before? I have not. Are you sure? No. Get out. Let's go. Sure. For your cheap again. <laughs> Now. My name is Zago. A 
great hunter in this community. Just all? What else you want? Okay, that's fine. I think I like you. A handsome, hard-working man like you is so real. What if I become your wife? What? Look, my dear, say yes to me and I turn your world. I'm not interested. Uh, to show you how serious I am. This is for you. people out there need this money more than I do. Huh? Take your riches to them. I am not seeking for any. Thank you. What wrong have I done? Why has he chosen poverty over wealth? Okay? I will get you. <laughs> ah, it's wonderful. Yes. You're welcome, my daughter. Um, thank you, Nai. Like as I said earlier, I and your son have been seeing ourselves for a very long time now. So I decided to come and make it known to the family. That is why I'm here. Oh. Ah, my daughter. But my son hasn't told us anything regarding to both of you meeting together. Uh, no. uh, uh, are you aware of... No, not at all. Me, he didn't. Uh, and maybe he's actually waiting for the right time to pass the information. But I met him on my way. And he told me that both of you are home. Oh, okay. Oh. If that is the case, wait for him now. He, he's coming back. Um, I don't have all the time, so... I think this will go a long way. Thank you. God bless you. Bye bye, email. for her. I have said my own. Oh. All I know is that my, my brother loves Mao. He loves Mao very, very well. Oh. I have um, said my own. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Daddy, hi. I'm not in support. Oh. Sylvia gets to see such a thing getting married. Are you the one getting married to that young man? I believe someone's choice in marriage should be respected. Listen to yourself, mother. Mother, just go ahead and listen to yourself. Who is the young man we're talking about? Who is he in question? No, mother, answer me. The same man of your kind, from St. Philip Center, a nobleman of this in Calabria. Uh, mother, please don't stress much. I think brother has been envious because that's the only thing that explains why he wouldn't be in support of me getting married. Yes, because that young man has achieved more feats than you can or you have as a prince. Ma, are you okay? Are you trying to insult me? Ma, you no, 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 not at all, brother. I'm not, I'm, I'll just state the fact. What, what, what nonsense fact are you talking about? Please, no, ma, answer me. I said it's okay. Please. The man has achieved. He's a great wrestler. He's a hunter. A warrior. And who is our prince? Princess Mother, do you hear? I said it's okay. What is okay? She's trying to be sarcastic. Mother, you're better say the right thing at the right time. 
Are you the one getting married? Please, it's okay. Let's just end it here. Um, you better go and get your own. Mother. Uh, Please. Thank you. What is, what is wrong with everyone? What is all this now? Knowing that we have two major days ahead of us, two important ceremonies coming up, I wouldn't like any problem. Let there be peace and tranquility in this palace until our visitors have come and gone. Yes, Your Excellency. Have I made myself clear? Yes, 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 yes Father. Uh, Princess Acha. Okay. Princess Mma. <laughs> my prince. Father. And my young prince. Yes, Father. I thank God I pulled all of you out <laughs> to let you know that the peace and tranquility we are talking about in this kingdom now lie in your hands. Yes, as we leave now, let it continue, let peace continue to reign until we come back. Okay? Yes, sir. Have I made my mind known to you? Yes, darling. Yes, That's how I want it to be. Yes, ma'am. My beautiful mother. I'm still waiting. It's okay. You hug me, mama. <laughs> you beautiful. Thank you, Mr. Jewel. That's all, that's all. <laughs> I know he wants to join me. He wants to join them. You think he's still a baby? <laughs> oh, go well, Father. Easy. Bye-bye. Ah. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? I'm afraid of what the outcome might become. <clears throat> what do you mean? <clears throat> the last time I tried buying his attention, okay. he made a fool of me. <clears throat> well, I don't think any man in his right senses will turn down the request of a princess. Maybe you are not pressing the right button. Bella, how can't you make a sentence without using radiance? I mean, I hit the nail on the head. The power of a woman. What? <laughs> so tell me, how's it been going? Just like I said earlier, you don't have anything to worry about. And Princess, it may interest you to know that I have a friend planted already to strip the princess mind of the hunter. Yeah. And this will automatically channel her heart to your brother. The wow. <laughs> Sounds interesting. 
But that was so fast. Not when money is involved. Oh. <laughs> so tell me, what would you like to take? My people, I welcome you all. It is said that the Ebekona will call out first before the responder will answer. And so, our visitors here have called for this gate together. And we are eager to know all that they have come to tell us. Our people said when discussion extends to the dusk, we no longer need proverbs. We have come today to hit the hammer on the nail. The same when a female child is born, she is first outside the house. And when a male child is born, he is first inside the house. And my son here, Ago, have come today to take in that which is faced outside the house to take it back to our own house. I'm a woman. I find wisdom in you. You are full of proverbs. You're welcome. Oh, I wish to crave your indulgence to plead with all of you that whosoever is seeking for my daughter's end in marriage should please rise for recognition. Live long, Your Highness. Please, long, my son. Your humble servant promised to take care of your daughter. I will not fail you, Your Highness. Um, um, Uncle, you can, you can rise. Don't worry, my father is not here. Stop this! Just rise and get out! You can't say that to our mother. Say you should get out. Your now. elder brother is talking to you. How very you? Enough! How you? Enough of this! Sorry, brother. Please. Drink. It is not over.
have you all of you are here. I want all of you to listen and listen good. When I'm serious, I am serious. I'm sounding this warning to all of you that no one of you should discuss what happened here a few hours ago until further notice. Have I made myself clear? Yes. yes. to welcome the princess of your land. Well, I ask the princess of the land what she is doing here, unprecedented. I just said, what are you doing here? Oh, you were saying six. OK, I six. Now, will you answer my question? What are you doing here? Apple, why is it so difficult for you to understand? I've done everything possible for you to understand, but you keep pushing me away. What exactly do you want? Car, money, luxury. I just mention it and it's all yours. And why is it so difficult for the princess of the land to understand that this man's heart belongs to her mother? Think it's all about money? Cars, luxury, and all that, I am not interested. Yes, I'm not. Okay, I'm sorry. Uh, can we talk about? We cannot talk about it. I'll go, come on. Princess, I, I will shout. Mate, Kwambu. Mate, Kwambu. In fact, when you're done, you know the way you came. Okay. Uh, uh, you can leave. You know the rules. Princess, I honestly do not have anything to do with this person. She has stopped me severally on the road. And I have told her severally that my heart belongs to someone. All right, so I, I don't know. You have to believe me. I honestly do not have anything to do with this person. Really? Yes. Believe me. It's fine. Princess. <laughs> wow! Look at your beauty here. Can you see it? Wow, this is beautiful. Yes! You are halfway away indeed. I can't compare you with anyone. Especially when I see you on your ceremonial dress like this. I begin to love you afresh. Oh, thank you, my husband. Mm -hmm. I love you so much. Thank you. It's as if I'm seeing you for the first time. <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't let them see you. I know you love me. I hope my daughters are as beautiful as you are. Why not, my king? When is your time to shine? Why not? I trust you. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
I love you so thank much. You. Thank you. Thank you very much. Let them come. Let me see them. I want to see them. I should come. Yes. Come here. Come here. We extend our hands of fellowship and cooperation to the people of Omaru Kingdom. I want to say thank you. Thank you very much for this warm reception, Iwe. Thank you very much, Iwe. Lovely, welcome. More so, it is said that united we stand, but divided we fall. Thank you for the unification. Thank you very much. Your Highness, King Uzurumba, the third of Umalo Kingdom. The good people of Umalo Kingdom, I greet you. I am the happiest king today. I slept and woke up. I reasoned that these two great communities establish more ties that will hold them more together. So I sent a visit request, which your amiable king responded so amicably, which prompted this wonderful occasion of today. In fact, I, Igbo Jike of Mbike, I promise we shall continue to be friendly and cooperative in all phase of our coexistence from now onward. Igwe. 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 Yes, no. Permit me to say this. Go ahead. I am highly delighted because this visit has put on the kinetic love which has eluded the two kingdoms for the case now. And I pray that the scope of the relationship be widened in the shortest possible time. Thank you. Thank you very much, Onobu. Thank you. Umaro Queen! Yeah. Umaro Queen! Yeah. In my local parlance, they say, Nampunaya, come okay, Otiti, why another am going to tear. That a man had been urging to shout, eventually, a woman picked it up first from him. <laughs> so, um, my people, I have been urging to do what Igwe Ojike had just done. You know? But I've been proposing and disposing it. Eh? But Ipojike took the pain, the gallant step, and made the move first. So I became perplexed. I thank you so much. I thank you. Well, as you can see, peace has returned. From now on, there shall be inter kingdom intercommunal marriage. Yes. <clears throat> Igwe, I want to thank you for this wonderful refreshment. <laughs> On behalf of my king, King Ojike, mm -hmm. I want to say thank you. Igwe, permit me to use this wonderful opportunity to introduce our second agenda for consideration. That Prince Obigwe here seeks the hand of your daughter, Princess Ma, in conjugal relationship. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> hmm. Ibo Jike. Yes, good news. Yes. It is good news. Because um, I have never seen a 
man that gave birth to my daughter, no matter how beautiful, and goes ahead to marry the daughter. Is it possible? No. And, uh, that's why I quickly reciprocated. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Now that this jinx of rancor, jinx of hatred and cold war is being broken, I pray that all of us will put our hands together. All hands must be on deck to make sure we keep the flag flying. Yeah. Ah, don't worry. We shall celebrate it. Yeah. Uh, meanwhile, what we are supposed to do first, we are doing it last. Then because of the necessity, we have to do it. That's not for you. Yeah. 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 Cannot speak a word without proverbs. <laughs> hey, please. Uh, no. Take this color now to the board and the best people. Your Highness. Yeah. That is good. Yes. You yeah, are welcome. The people of Mbike, this is color. <laughs> this is color. Uh, as now, OGS. La Quarese. Oh no. Thank you. Yes. Yes. Hold on a moment. Come on, win! Yeah. Come on, win! Yeah. Come on, win! Yeah. Come on, win! Yeah. Please hold on. Um. My people say, no matter what you with the land. Yes. That he who presents. Kola North brings life. And I want to let us know that Kola North doesn't hear English or any other language except Igbo language. Yes. Because it is, only, it is only Igbos that recognizes the importance of Kola North. We use it to do communion of saints. So we use it to call down God Almighty. We use it to call down our ancestors who left this world for us to live in. So now let us pray. Let's do justice to it. Chuko Kiko Abiyama, Senye Kelegi, the creator of hell and get at everything in there, to come and give this cola in God. And uh, we know as it is the cola, there are some pebbles of it, some pieces of it that may fall down. And that is the ones we are going to eat. We also call on our ancestors who have passed on our forefathers to join us in eating the peace that fall down from the throne of God. We pray that this color will give us life, give us love, give us unity, we prosper us as we pray according to the will of God. Mother. Mother, I do not find some the reason for parents choosing their children's arms. Sweetie, I really understood the angle where you're coming from. You are right, my son. But even at that, I believe his majesty, your father. His decision still carries the day. Now tell me, who this care from? Mother, we have not given our nod to any of them. And that remains my take. That's very good. Then who do you prefer to order? Mother, my preference might not be perfect. So I would rather go with Father. Let's hand everything to God in prayers and fasting. Let's seek his consent. Um, Mom, yes. I am Princess Mima. We've already started our fasting and prayer. That's very good, Mother. And um, Mother, I hope I am exempted because this tummy needs food. I can't go a day without food. No, it's... you are not. It's not for my I said it here. I'm, I'm serious. Actually, that's the sound. Oh. 
birthday now. Honestly, my king, she has not spoken to me, nor has seen me since then. I know. So what are you going to do? She's in a battle of choice. I don't want to stop her. I love her to be. <laughs> You're so cool. You're a modest. My friend is. And you added some more points with me. Excuse me, my friend. Excuse me. Enough! Let me be with my feet. Princess. What was that? What, what was that reaction about? Nothing, I guess, my praise. Maybe, maybe, maybe she's in her period. You know how this gender can be. What kind of stupid talk is that I'm telling you of something important and, and you're being comic? Did you see the way she walked out? My praise, calm down. When they say I'm inside. Period, they help their body. Huh? Huh? What is that that troubles my dazzling morning star? Please, my queen. Transfer all the anger in your heart. Transfer them to me. And I will bear it with ease. And if the queen will allow me a minute of her time, I will transform all the bitterness in her heart to honey. <laughs> My love, you caused no harm. I wouldn't transfer my aggression to the innocent. The joy of the bone of my bone is my strength. And her decision is like an excruciating pain onto my bone. This is a physical symbol of my true and unflinching love for you. Oh my God. Please accept it. Of course. Oh my God. Oh. This is... This is so beautiful. You like it? God. I love it. Go. What do you care? Maybe. But it might interest you that I funded it. What? What you should be doing now is thanking me for my generosity towards you and your family. Or why not ask your parents? How the money they used for your introduction came up. If I were you, I will face this world that is knocking on your door right now. Stand by me, stay with me forever. I will love you to the end, to the end of time. The love I have for you, I will cherish forever. Oh, won't you know my love? Hey, can we go? Papa? Papa? Ma, what is it I'm hearing? Huh? What are you hearing? What is it in them? You're asking me what is it in them? I will, this house will fall. 
I will raise this house if what I am hearing is the truth. How did you guys get the money you, you, you used for my introduction? How did you get the money? Is that what this shout is? Okay, so it's not enough to shout. It is not enough to shout. Papa, if you do not tell me how you get this, the money I use for my introduction, I will, I will raise this house. I will, I will break. Heaven will let Your loose. friend gave us the money. Yes, yes. Huh? Uh, your friend gave us the money now. My friend. Uh -huh. Which of my friends? She came and said that two of you have been moving together. And that even she saw you when she was coming to the house. And you told her to come and meet us at home. Uh -huh. And she came and gave us money. She? Yes. Hey. How did you hey. Somebody walked into this house and told you that we are dating number one. And secondly, I, I, I asked her to give you all the money and, and you bought the story. You took, you embraced the story. Get it again. I'm going to primary school. I'm going to have a kid. I'm going to have a kid. Okay. I'm going to have a kid. Get it again. Get it again. Huh? Okay, no problem. Since have you have you heard from me that I am dating another girl apart from Princess Emma? What is all this? I go batra batano. No problem. If you know how you collected the money, return it. I I am. Papa. But Papa, why should you collect money from from on behalf of my brother without his consent? I want you people. I want you to go anymore. Very cuckoo. Very cuckoo. Baba and guy is useful. The guy got more digging. Chinese cap of Bangkok. What bread does my friends? The only hope of the kingdom of Mbeki. Who does my prince while their father is still alive? Bet me, the end of your agony is now. Now tell me in the confidence of the prince to his faith to his father, what makes you so angry? Speak, son, for your father is here to rescue you. I am the king of Mbike Kingdom. Father, this is three days. Three days gone, Father. No word from King Ozumba. Am I no water or what? Calm down, my prince. Now listen. Sometimes, silence is so powerful than words. Bury your words and actions in your heart. But don't forget, a patient dog eat the fattest bone. There you go again, Father. I'm not Nancy. That Prince Hugo and the what they what they call it, uh, Agu. God does not want to long man, man came. Father, I'm finished. <laughs> you are not finished, my son. Whatever has no solution, the solution is not far fetched. This is a simple business for the kings. Your father is on top of it. <laughs> hey! I'm sure the things happen. Yes, my son. I know what you can do. Yes. How old are you? I will bring her back to this party. Oh, you mean that, yeah? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> How old are you guys? You don't have to. We are embarking on a journey that is pregnant. Mm -hmm. No one knows what the outcome will be to be successful. But I've given you my blessings that you'll be successful. Thank you, Father. Oh, say, I will be with you in spirit. You say, thank you, Father. Father, <laughs> I will surely make you. I will yes. bring her to this palace. Yes. It's going to be a success. <laughs> Come in, my king. My king, there does I am. Okay. Okay. Let's think about this. The queen of me. Thank you. I know what I will bring down. You're going to make me proud. Okay. See what we've done. 
Are you serious? <laughs> Baby, you're not just. Ah, yeah. What? Asalugo! How dare you test something before the given time for us to eat? Are you insane? What? <laughs> Wait. Mma. You asked if I'm insane. Oh, yes. Because it's only insane people that flood the other big way. Then you I will show you what insanity is. How baby, it is insanity. Jesus, that is to show you what insanity is. Eh? Are you mad? Did you not do this? Do what you want to do. Because I cautioned you for flooding the others of our father. You bought the drink on me. If you took her, I will use this bottle on your head. Hey, hey, you will see today. Today, this is the bottle. What, 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 For the last time, and I'm saying you should drop the spot to it as an order. Do you understand? What is going on? Why did you decide to jump the protocol of a royal visit? My good friend, my people say, Afwife Kaubi, Eloba. That is to say, if they see something more valuable than farm, they sell their barn. <laughs> Please, I'm, I'm trying to understand what you're saying. What is more valuable than their farm? My good friend, you don't have to be in a haze because a parcel that will be open does not need to be pinched. Mm. So what could that mean? Ah, uh, you know, we are busy licking our fingers. Are we going to hang them in place of fire? Honestly, Ugo, at this point, I am going to believe that you are trying to make a fool of me and I am your host. Ugo, if there's anything you need to say, just go ahead and say it. My good friend, Afumwa, I'm sorry to let you down just that I am tactically waiting for the appearance of your father. Ugo Ozurumba. What for? Uh, I'm so sorry, but I believe it's Better, I announce it once in the presence of the whole royal family. Uh, uh, Prince Ugo, I need to tell you this. My father, the king of Umaru kingdom, King Ozurumba III, does not accept disrespect and insubordination. My host, if I tell you I am not wise, it's simply your language that is making me a fool. Prince Ugo, I've said this before, and I am going to repeat myself. 
my father the king does not in any way tolerate disrespect dishonor and subordination unexpected visitation look i am going to advise you to go back come up with a meeting date fix an authentic date and follow it up my good friend a child who does not know how to go errant does it twice my father the great king of Mbuku kingdom is one we never take a fool as a son if i should return to him without laying off the burden of the secret of my coming to the yearning minds and to the ears of the prince and princesses of Umaro kingdom that means i am a fool mm. yeah Ugo, you're beginning to sound very, very wise. So, go ahead. I'm all ears. Okay. Uh, the reason of my visit is I want to ask the hand of your sister, Princess Ma, in marriage. <laughs> That's interesting. animals and bed in the sky. Have you not done enough? Have you not done enough to succeed yet? You cannot and you will not rest. Listen, I want you to repeat after me. Otherwise, I'll blow off your brains. That I... That I... Flora. Say your name! Flora! Will never come close to Ago or Princess. Will never come close to her. Uh, Agua, princess. The day I do. The day I do. May my life be snatched away from me. Say it! May my life be, be, be snatched away from me. Say amen. Shout amen. Amen. Now talk. Leave with your cat on. Move. Move. Fat like a cow. White like a chalk. Start your car and live here. On sense. hear you and me voice. Just use your hand. Come out everything when you call my shop Komboru. It's a waste time. Boro pose. You borrow, you pose. Nothing gummy. Chichi, fadi, no gummy. Nothing, nothing. Nothing come out. They borrow, they pose. Fine woman. No, no money. F fine woman, no money. Give me a bag. Come on, give me. You, you come Komboru. To return on a problem. The car and the baby can find me when I be. We have to see you, but you say again, mommy. Nonsense. Wait, wait, wait. Find me, mommy. Oh, yeah, the earrings have come out. See you. Fine woman, no money, poor pose. Nonsense. Stop! Come up for that. Come down. 
Kinder. Please, now, I was just coming to the house. Please. Please. I will not meet you, please. We are two days. May you are two days in the Please. Please, Wait. now. Please, I'm begging you. I give you my motor. Just look at him now, look at him. I know. You mean friendly, put him out of Noah. You mean friendly. Please, please, I'm about to come. You mean friendly, put him out of Noah. Please, because then, because... You give me to me, you go out for two days. Madam, you are four days. Please, I'm begging you. It's okay, I'm here, I'm here. Give me the motor, give me the keys. Please, now don't do me like this now, please. Come on, please, now don't do me like this. Come on, come on, come on. Please, I'm begging you, I'm begging you, please. Please. Leading you on this journey and bringing you back safely. My prince, I hope everything went smoothly. Son, talk to us. Your Highness, everything went well. No fighting, no misunderstanding, and no quarreling. Please, my prince, you take the rest of this way. My son, what is it? Who got here? What is it? What do you What do you got here? Who got? What the hell is going on here? What is going on? When it comes to the issues of family discussion, every frayed nerve should come down. You see, there is nothing happening today that is new. And there is nothing the eyes will see today and begin to run blood. My prince, Ogobeke, tell me exactly what happened over there that got you so angry. Please don't speak to us, please. Father, I was belittled enough. I was humbled by my contemporaries. Father, Father, why? Why will I be humiliated by my supposed equal? Father, you need to see how I stood in the presence of the whole royal family, looking stupid. Stop right there. What do you mean, looking stupid? I hate self-humiliation. No, Father. Why would my father tell my part to? Why would my father not understand my simple, expressive words? I never castigated, humiliated, or humbled myself. Father, they did. Why would they know that respect is reciprocal? That I had to book an appointment with King Ozumba just to receive his audience. Father, Father, you need to see how your son, Prince Ugu of Mbuku Kingdom, was seen as ordinary citizen in another man's land, Father. All oh, because of my foolish father. My son, stop right here. It's okay, it's okay. Don't worry your head anymore. No one has a right to humiliate my own son. I will handle this matter. Don't worry your head over it. I will send a message to King Ozumba, and I will take care of this issue. Okay? Don't worry your head over this anymore. No sense. No one has a right to humiliate my own son. Everything is going to be fine. I assured you that. Okay. I will handle it. It's okay. I assure you. It's okay, Uncle. Greetings, Your Majesty. Of what good is your greetings? When you cannot carry out a simple task, Your Majesty. Shut up. I paid you handsomely and gave you all the necessary things to carry out this task. But what do you do? You just came here to tell me stories? Your Majesty, the both parties are hard nuts to crack. I, I would suggest you, you, you let them be. Destiny, they say, can never be denied. Get out. 
Get out! Out. Imaginable. I mean, who does that in this century? <laughs> no wonder Princess Mama of Omaro Kingdom never fancy Prince Ugo. I mean, a woman will always want a man who can stand up. <laughs> oh, my yeah, dear. Yeah. Always gossiping. Nothing more. Come on, will you do that now and leave about Ngwangwa? I'm not calling you here. Chief guard. <laughs> My incoming governor, be rest assured that I will do everything in my capacity to support you. <laughs> Please, I will, I will get back to you. My husband. Yes, my queen. I'm so much worried about our son. He has refused to eat nor drink anything for days now. You mean the prince refused to eat? Yes, my king. What do we do? Father, I suggest you call the prince and talk to him. Who knows? He may listen to you. That's a wonderful idea, my princess. Thank you, father. But what if he refuses? Let's give it a try, father. Yes. Chief Mary. My king. Call the prince for me. Okay, my king. Father. Yes, ma'am. You sent for me? Yes. What happened? You have neither eaten nor drank for days. And of what importance is food? Father. Mother. Son. I don't know. If I lose Uma, I, Prince Obigwe, I will kill myself. Hmm. Excuse me. Son? God! Father! Father, please, you have to do something fast. I don't want anything to happen to my brother, please. He's, he's losing it. Consider it done. Thank you, Father, please. God! Please, my Now, listen and listen very carefully. Go to the king of Umaru Kingdom. Tell him, my son, the prince of the of Umbuku Kingdom has neither eaten nor drank anything for days now. Tell him to please grant my son his hard desire to marry Princess Ma, the hard trouble of my son. You can go now. Please, please be fast about it. Go. The good and the supposedly blessed event that numerous families have been praying for to have came to us on a platter of gold. The rather it turned our faces sad and our hearts bitter. I believe strongly, in fact, I am optimistic that our coming together today is going to usher in peace, tranquility, and unity. Amen. So, Mama, Father, I would like you to eschew all bitterness 
and tell the people that owe you what your heart desires that we do for you to make you happy. Thank you, Father. Father, you taught us all how to pray and believe in God, trusting in his words and words alone. Therefore, I went on my knees just as you thought. And I called upon him, and the Holy Spirit revealed unto me that I should engage three of them in a contest. Yes, Father. But, but before that, I, I thought it wise to seek for the opinions of my parents and, and siblings. Wow. God be the glory. Amen. That is good. I knew it, that he will never fail us. So, you see, as a matter of fact, I prayed too. And God called me by my name and said, My son, today, peace shall return in your home. Amen. It has already started to manifest. Mm -hmm. I'm so happy. Mm -hmm. um, my queen, as you can see, you are the mother of the house. So, who among the three do you prefer to come for our daughters and the marriage? My king, honestly, I'm very, very happy. Now that you're ready to open up. As for my own opinion, I believe your father here has said it down. But you have the final decision. Okay? But since you want to know our minds, I will say you marry into a real family who are the plus. But even at that, I have no objection to your opinion. Sir. That's good. But um, which of the two royal families are you talking about? Any of the two. Any of the two. We have a close decision of your Well, well, well. The mother of the house has voiced out her opinion as a non choice and a judge. Let's hear from our friends. My friends, Father, um, what is your take? Well, Father, I am going to make my suggestions with some reasons. Firstly, you see, Father, Prince Hugo is from a royal family with great esteem. Secondly, that young man is very handsome. He is sociable. He is well educated. Thirdly, we all know that Prince Hugo has been a very long friend to the royal household. I prefer your father. Oh, well, <laughs> I can like to say that issue with your nanny and just. Yes. Um, let's hear from our princess, Acha, Acha Rudo. Father, as much as we are free to make suggestions on whom my sister should marry, I feel she is old enough to know where the pendulum of her heart tears to. But if I wear her, I'll stop chasing shadows. Father, one is not as you to a child over the animal you kill. I prefer the shoe. Thus, I know where it cringes. Please, Father, send out the mercenaries to the kings. For in a good time, we'll be hosting a contest. A hunting and wrestling contest. And whoever emerges the winner will automatically become my husband. 
May God Almighty see them through, Father. Amen. 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 That's good. Amen. That's good. Please, let us do this with one mind. We have all heard it. Now you two should listen. I want you to go to the kings of Mbuku and the Mbike kingdoms. I don't want you to go separately. Go together. Tell them, I am giving them 16 days. 16 days, I said, for their sons to compete on hunting and wrestling that will climax it. And whoever among their children that emerges the winner will take the hands of my daughter in marriage. Have I made myself clear? Yes, Your Majesty. I hope you heard me clearly. Yes, Your Majesty. Now go. My heart my of my flesh, my head, my heart. It feels so good to set my eyes on you. <laughs> My love, you know my heart yearns for you. My eyes, they admire you. And my body deserves you all days of my life. I can't wait for this endless sleepless night be over one day. But they that I will dwell in the ocean of my love for you. <laughs> and that day shall come. Because with God everything is possible. Just believe. You know it is written. That Egyptians we see today, we shall see them no more. Just believe. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for your courage. I mm. appreciate you. You gain my heart more. <laughs> ah, that reminds me. <clears throat> my father, the king of Umaru Kingdom, the wise man. You know he is a wise man. Thus he has set a wrestling and hunting contest for three of you. Whosoever emerges the winner qualifies to be my husband. Huh? But don't worry. I know with God on our side, you shall emerge the winner. What can I say, if not God? I commit my strength and my haunting powers unto you. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Thank you, my princess. The Queen of Mbike Kingdom, how are you today? How is London? <laughs> we are missing you. Yes, we are missing you here. Okay. My king. I'll call you back, okay? Yes. So, let me see from the rural community, six for your audience. Okay. Let me take care of you. Welcome, my son. You look like a royal guy. Yes, you do. Who sent you? I was sent by King Uzurumba from Umaru Kingdom. A wrestling contest has been set for the suitors of Princess Uma in two weeks' time. Whosoever that emerges the winner marries the princess. Wow, that's a great news. That's a welcome news. You're welcome, my son. Thank you, Yubi. 
May I take my leave now? May the gods of our land see you through back. He said, tell the king, Uzuruba, that we shall meet on the contest arena. Thank you, Nikki. You're welcome. That's a very good news. Yes. Yes, very good news. <laughs> Hi. The eyes of the gods. Do whatever you can to make him the best wrestler in this community. Fortify him within two weeks. Give him the best luck in wrestling. Yes. Your Highness, I, the mouthpiece of the gods of UBK Kingdom, shall do very best and leave the rest to the gods of honor. Good. The gods will hear our prayers. As for you, give him the best wrestler one has ever had in this community. I will give you every incentive you may require. Consider it. I shall take my leave. Coming to an alarming stage. I don't know what to do next. The last messenger I sent to Mar. They turned with the message that means absolutely nothing. The eh? Ruba just said, uh, I will hear from him soon. When is soon? Nonsense. Father, I mean, would you permit me to pay Princess Emma a visit? Who knows? Maybe she will be wowed by my pleasantries and mobility. Yeah. My king. I think our daughter is right. Yeah. Mm, that's a wonderful idea. And how bitter will you feel when you get humiliated again for the second time for dragging into her kingdom with that prior knowledge and permission? I think I should be sending her message. You should try it. Thank you. Thank you. Excuse me. Um, some messengers from Mumaru Kingdom are here to see you. Bring them in. Rumba sent us to tell you to prepare Prince Ugo for contest of hunting and wrestling that will take place in a week time. Oh yes, yeah, Igwe, that the winner becomes husband to Princess Uma. This is interesting. This is really interesting. Igwe, may we take our leave now? May the gods bless you and lead your way. Send my regards to my childhood friend. In goes Rumba. My prince has an opportunity. This is good. This is good news. My son. And the ego lower is standard to touch with kites or can the lion humiliate itself and dwell in the same forest with foxes. Father, I'm, I'm just tired of all this drama. I'm thinking of forgoing my heart desire than becoming too ambitious, Father. My son, cowards die many times before the real battle. 
The villains die but once. Pride ruins us. Now. Ambitions and victories. I want you to be courageous. Have confidence in yourself. Have faith in your abilities. Go into this battle. Thank you, Father. I thank you so much. I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go to the house.
say, it. He said. As I was saying, this is like a field. It is like war between towns. Yes. And we are not going to leave any stone unturned until we achieve victory. Yes. Our gods have assured us. And we have the backing and support of our ancestors. They are not asleep. The secret is this. The seed is a very viable one. From a viable, respectable, and majestic King Ozumba. <laughs> our chief priest is here. And we have the full support of our gods and our ancestors. So, victory is ours. Victory is ours. Take a lead. Get my leg Let us pray that the God we serve to have his way in our forthcoming wrestling competition. Father, you know our hearts. You know we cannot do without you. We commit the forthcoming wrestling competition into your hand. We pray, O oh Lord and my God, that you see us through dominate, have your way, do not allow us to be put to shame, do not allow any fetish power to come there and triumph. What's the problem? Greetings, Your Majesty. Greetings. There is a maiden outside that seek for your audience. A maiden? Yes, Your Majesty. From where? From MBK, Your Majesty. From MBK? Yes, Your Majesty. Go and bring her in. Who could that be? Which is my king? Young girl, what do you seek in my kingdom? And who are you? Your Majesty, I brought information. Information? From where? From Mbaike, Your Highness. From Mbaike? Stop crying and tell me what the problem is. Your Majesty, I was on an errand for my mother, close to the little square at Mbaike. While I was on my way, I saw Prince Obiigwe with a man of Mbaike and the chief priest giving him instructions at the back of his palms, his feet, and on his chest. Your Majesty, they were fortifying him for the contest that is supposed to be natural. Oh, oh, oh. <clears throat> Come, my daughter. Come. Come. You mean what you are telling me is true? Yes, Your Majesty. <clears throat> um, we thank God for everything. The answer to our prayers just manifested. Yes! They wouldn't know. Our Father in Heaven works in mysterious ways. Thank you, Father, for this revelation. My daughter, My who is your father? Let's Mr. Okonta. let Mr. Okonta. I see. Wow. Good. Now listen, daughter. Because you have the interest of this kingdom at heart, bringing us such a revelation, 
such information after this our meeting my daughter will see you to know you better okay and I want to make a promise I want to pronounce a promise to you if my my son the prince of this great kingdom Prince Afumwa refuses to take your hand in marriage I, the king of this kingdom, we have your hand in marriage. And father. Yes. What? What? That is what I will do. My king. Excuse me. <laughs> Stay outside and wait for us. Can you imagine? Okay. Michael wasn't that. I don't know the meaning, but I have told you to stop. Stop! <sighs> Honor, we have to pray that the God we learn to serve will intervene in tomorrow's contest. I know that the revelation that came to us that <clears throat> Some other communities, some other kingdoms are not seeing it from our own perspective. I want us to call on God to intervene so that any fetish thing that they, they will bring in there will destroy it. Let's pray in the name of Jesus. Father, you said we are two or three are gathered in your name, you are there. You said that whatever we agree upon on the face of this earth will be established in heaven. We pray this moment that our tomorrow's occasion, event, is going to be a success. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. We pray that whosoever comes there not believing in you with any fetish power will be destroyed, Amen. will be disgraced. Amen. Father, we pray that your will will triumph. Amen. Let he that you want to be the suitor of my daughter, of our daughter, triumph tomorrow. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. And the amen. It is settled. Settled. <laughs> so shall it. Almighty and everlasting God, the maker of heaven and earth and the king of our souls, Father, we've come before you with our hearts full of pain. For the enemy has set a snare to snatch the desire of my heart. But please do not let it stand. Amen. For you said in your word where two or three are gathered, you are in our midst. And so we believe you are in our midst. Father, for it is written in your word that we should decree a thing in your name and it shall be established. With that understanding, we decree and declare any power they come with. Father, let it not stand in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. King of King, Lord of Lord, let all their powers, any power that is not of you, Father, let it fail and let victory be ours. Amen. For tomorrow we are going out. Mm. We are going out with so much expectations in our yes, hearts. Yes. For you said in your word, our expectations shall not be cut short. Without understanding, Father, 
as we live with so much expectations, we shall come back with victory in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. We shall come back with overwhelming joy in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. In Jesus' name, Amen. I pray. Yes, Lord. My sister's joy is my own joy. Therefore, I ask, grant her her heart desire. Amen. Because you are the only living God yes, Lord. and you are with us. Oh, yes, the Bible said that one with God is more than majority. Oh, yes. Therefore, I pray that at the end of this whole thing, we shall return with joy. Amen. Just like she said, we are going to return here with overwhelming joy. Amen. Grant Amen. us all round victory. Amen. Grant her her heart desire. Amen. Grant her her heart desire. Amen. Grant her her heart desire. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father, because as you have said it, so you have heard us. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Let's share the grace. May, May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. The love of God and, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit. Before we proceed, we will do what the tradition demands. I'm calling off uh, uh, King Kola upon Mahal, to present Kola to his guest. Yes, sir. Happy day indeed. And uh, like the moderator said, we have to do the necessary. <clears throat> and so, take this color to the kings. Thank you very much for the cola. Uh, the good people of Umbike, this is cola. So, the prince will proceed to the king of the king. How do you majesty? There's a offer. have seen the king's scholar. The king's scholar is the king's hand. A big round of applause. They are not just uh, ruling the people, they are also the custodian of the cause of, uh, and tradition of the people. Uh, a short prayer. We would say that Kula does not hear English. I believe, we all believe it, that uh, Kola North does not hear English language. Nor does it hear any other language apart from African language. Chiko Kika Biyama, Ezebine Enu Ogedana Bolana, Ayeke Enegi, I call Gia and Kenya Rai. Kola signifies unity, the communion of saints. So, Tata, I know you're going to be a Makota or Gia. I'm 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 going to be a Makota I say about Jack, I thought I'm doing your wine. You are my game, Nettianeta. This is a gathering of unification. A big round of applause for this is Rumba Faro. One thing he told me some time ago, he said the spelling of OJ is OJI. That O stands for Omenala. Then J stand for Jikoro. Then I stand for Igbo. 
Uh, that is Omena Lajikoro. Uh, we have to come. <laughs> so we proceed from that at uh, this juncture. Um, we actually want to bring in. But let me tell you, first of all, that what we have come here to do is uh, what our grandfathers have been doing and then uh, we continue doing it after them. Uh, today we are going to do some wrestling. This wrestling is not just for all comers, it's for those who want to ask for the hand of the daughter of King of Ezaro in marriage. You know, as a pocritudinous woman, I mean as a beautiful woman, so many people have been trying to find, to, to seek for her hand in marriage. There were so many that were resorted to our old tradition of with them coming to slog it out by means of uh, traditional wrestling. That's exactly what we are doing today. So you are all welcome. As you have come, I want to remind you one thing that you are either standing, sitting, or squatting in the presence of three great traditional majesties. A big round of applause. <laughs> and as such, it will not be a kind of reprimand or rebuke for me to remind you that you have to conduct yourself in the most decorous manner so that your ancestor, our ancestors, will know that, uh, that so that the progenitors, let me go is the same word, the progenitors will know that their progeny are people that are actually cerebral. A big round of applause for that. So having said that, we are going direct to usher in the various communities and their wrestlers and their princes to come and take their seat. So, uh, it will be very wise to introduce the two kingdoms whose princes are seeking for the hand of my beauty in marriage. To my right hand, we have the Mbike kingdom. A big round of applause for them. On my left hand side, we probably have the beautiful people. It seems to me that these people are very strong. But these people are too beautiful. Even their men are equally beautiful, not just handsome. So, uh, this is in a way of introducing the Mbubu people. A big round of applause for them. Um, we are now introducing we are now introducing the various wrestlers and their uh, seers or princes or whatever who will lead them or share them into the ring and then give them that mysterious guide and direction and protection to do exploit for their kingdom. Um, well, my son, you taught us to learn and believe from your supposed spouse. But what I am saying is that if our adventure you fail at last, do not put the blame on us. Do not. What would you have me do, Father? At least I would have stepped out to look for solution. Because I believe everything has a solution. Yes, my son, your father is right. He would have gone out to seek for solution from the gods and the ancestors. And I know he would have gone this, got to the solution. How can you speak in such manner, mother? mother, mother? Uh, Father, have you forgotten what the same God has done for me? Have you forgotten what he has done for me? 
how he has saved me from, from, from deadly animals. How he averted all the evil attacks of my rival hunters. And you want me to abandon that God? Father, it will not happen. As a truth, those your opponents, they went far in search of victory. What do you know? What do you know about victory and in search of whatever it is? I'll start with you now and you cannot complete it. Princess Ma has shown me life. And her God is who I will serve. Do I perish, I perish. If I die, I die. But I know he does not change. Why is it? Brother! Brother! I... Mama. Now we proceed uh, by introducing a various wrestler. Uh -huh. Standing in front of me, you will see the Amuku wrestler, followed by their native doctor. Came when they were still, uh, you know, doing the show my sheep, they, they uprooted one uh, hero, uh, hero country which was here, and uh, even their competitors ran away for fear that, uh, uh, as it is said, Ebokubara, Mbe, Mbe Wobuibe, Kebuni Hege Mokuko. They are coming again. We hope that we have a lot to share today. We want to usher in the chief priest of the host kingdom. 
What are you doing here? I'm in support of you, brother. You're in support of me. Get out. of our villagers going with us, even as witness. Father, how many people did you invite? I invited a lot of people, but it's obvious none of them showed up. What about you, mother? Son, I invited my friends, but you can see, none of them is here. But my friends said we are not offering food. Drinks or money. Even if the entire village rejects me, God in heaven will not reject me. My victory is heavenly bound, not by my power, but by the spirit of the Lord of hosts. The mountain I see on my way to victory shall be removed by the spirits. I shall go. I shall see, and definitely I will conquer. He that keepeth Israel does not sleep or slumber. Victory is mine. Let it be on record. <laughs> uh, however, it is untraditional for somebody not to represent uh, the host kingdom. So at this juncture, there is somebody I don't know much of him and his artistry and sophistry. Uh, uh, one ago, hey, look at him coming with his uh, parents. Hey, you might sit down there. You might sit down there. Um, at this juncture, let me actually tell us uh, apart from the uh, Eso Zurumba, of uh, Omaro, he's the host king here. Just greet them. Thank you 
you very much. Now we go to Mbike. Uh -huh. the, the king of Mbike, Chilipoli, greet us. Or an Akese, Kelen! Kelen! The good people of Mbike, Kelen! Kelen! You're welcome. A big round of applause for them. Now we go to Mbupu. Uh -huh. uh, let the king of Mbupu do the same thing. Oh, I need it. Kenu! Mbuku, Kenu! Mbike, Kenu! Mbaro, Kenu! Um, I want to tell us, maybe those who were not here in time, that what we have come here to do is something which our ancestors have been doing. Uh, our daughter is uh, the most beautiful woman on earth. And I want to believe she's more beautiful than, uh, than Helene, the most beautiful woman in Greece, uh -huh. whose beauty cost the legendary Greek and Trojan War, where people like Achilles show their power. Yes. Uh, but however, here we have our own method. No bloodletting. And we want to go about it in the most civilized way. So whoever today triumph over the rest is the one who is actually going to have the hand of this most beautiful damsel on earth uh, at, at this juncture, I will tell you that uh, it's not a kind of um, reprimand for me to tell you, because there are people who say, mind yourself, or they get to more of them. Uh, for me to tell you that you have to mind yourself, conduct yourself in the most decorous way, uh, so that uh, your ancestors will be very proud of you. Um, We are now summoning the two priests from these two kingdoms. They are the ones who actually won the hand of Mma in marriage. So, the priests of Mbike, come up. Onyaja, give a round of applause for him. The prince of Umbuku, step out. Uh -huh. That's right. 
is representing this uh, local kingdom. Uh, uh, where is Ago? Ago, you can come forward. Where is Ago? We are making progress. At this juncture, uh, we are calling the wrestler from whom we can to come up and uh, take the representative of Omaro by name Ado. I said I don't know him or I have not seen him kill a rabbit, even a rat, let alone coming in this very big arena. A million of applause for them. Are you not confident in your representative? complete animal. So we are getting there. Uh, we saw that the wrestler of Mbuku defeated the wrestler of uh, Mbika. And the Ago defeated the wrestler of Mbika. Now we are going to the grand final. And that will be between the wrestler of Mbuku and uh, uh, well, our own Agu of Omaro. Our own Agu. Yes. So, uh, the wrestler of uh, Mbuku, come out. Let's decide the final. Challenge Ago. Bring some. 
Unimaginable has happened. I want to say whether you are won, whether you are the winner, let us accept ourselves with happiness and joy, bearing in mind our purpose of organizing this. It is for us to be in unity, to trust our law in the unity. And I believe we have achieved it. Therefore, without taking much of our time, my people, I wish to announce it for the three kingdoms that have gathered. That Agro is my son-in-law. And the winner of wrestling. Hands of God for him. I want to call my daughter, Princess Ma. I want to see you here. Your heart desire has been achieved today. That is to prove that man is not God. Otherwise, I must have to confess, the entire family was against her for making her own choice of husband. But the God we serve has given her a wonderful support today. Please have some applause. I therefore, I therefore want to hand my daughter over to my son-in-law. Kneel down, Ago. Let me have your hand. Bring your hand. I join the two of you today, husband and wife. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much, King Osurumba of uh, Omaru. Mama, Mama, home. I'm a mom. Mama. Hey. 
Abama, I hope there is no trouble. Have you committed anything at Umaro? Mama, hey. don't kill her with questions. Uh, Are you her mother? I'm her mother, my son. Your daughter has found favor in the sight of the royal family. Ibu Uzumba demand to see you tomorrow. Me? Yes, Mama. Hey. Please, Mama, I have to take my leave. Uh, yes, Ma. Ghost of our land. Mama. Hey. My daughter. Hmm? Mama. How are you? How have you been? Abomma, my daughter. Mm -hmm. Hey. Let's let's go inside. What did you cook? Uh, what I cooked. I hope all is well. I'm going inside. Abomma, I hope all is well. Abomma. Stop mumbling me. Come, 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 come. Where is she? Come and sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Only a cotu igodo. Igodo ye kote. Eh? I know there is a trouble. There is a problem. Look at your face. Eh? Hi! What is it I'm hearing? What evil have you committed against the king of Omar? Mama, I did not do anything. Eh? Abomma. Abomma. Mama. Hey! Nti na no ihe. Ebu pisi. Nti esoria. Eh? What is this your parable in everywhere? See? Nya 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 you're moving, moving, moving. If any evil comes out of it, you will face it squarely. Abom, I said, you will face it squarely. Hey! Mother. Daughter. Mama. Mm -hmm. You've always taught me, let my yes be my yes. And my no, my no, which I've been practicing. So if any evil will warrant this, then I'm ready to go for it. Eh? Yes. Hey! Look what here. The ghost of our land. Please, in your hands I commit my daughter. Please. I don't have anything to defend myself or my daughter, please. Please, the loss of our land, save her for me. All is well. All is well. Ah. We are sent from the royal family, Igwe Ozurumba, that henceforth your daughter becomes the wife of the heir apparent to the throne, Prince Afuma. Hey, my daughter. Yes, ma'am. Hey, Chuku. Greetings. Have smiled at us. My sons, repeat what you told me before my daughter. Yes. We are sent from the royal family. Uh -huh. Yes. Igwe Uzurumba. That henceforth, your daughter here becomes the wife to the heir apparent to the throne, Prince Afoma. Why? <laughs> Aboma, my daughter. Me. You. <laughs> Why, for no? <laughs> to the heir apparent. <laughs> the ghost. I finally remembered us. My daughter. Hey! Open the mic, Becky. Family of Okonta, you're welcome. I am so happy and pleased that you did not turn my request down. Thank you for the honor. I wish to tell you that your daughter, Abomma, 
has found favor in the prince of Umar Romuike Kingdom. I wish to announce to you that we are hooking the two of them as husband and wife. Ibe. Yes. From now we will take up her responsibility as a wife of this household. So come forward, my daughter. Come forward. Abomma, Your Majesty. Today I declare you a legally married wife. To Prince Afuma. <laughs> and with this symbol, you remain his wife until death. <laughs> and I say, it shall be well with you. Yes. yes. You will live with him and grow into maturity. Amen. You shall together brew children and you shall have children, children. to see me. No, you failed it. Then tell me what it is. Okay, come. Prince Ugo have got me made him to marry. Yes! Go so for land! Go so for land! Thank you! Oh, thank you! Are you serious? Yes, mother. Who? Hmm. You will not believe Ooh. me. Calm down. Calm down. Oh. I shall go. The first daughter of King Ozirumba of Umaro Kingdom. Yes! <laughs> yes! 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 yes. <laughs> I know it! I'm so happy. I know I'm our so gods happy. are not asleep. <gasps> what? Mother, stop. I know our gods are not asleep. Thanks be to our gods. The king of Hades. No, mother. Do not make mention of the gods to the prince. Else, you will see the best in him. Yes. Why, why would you sound like that? Huh? Speak no blasphemy against the gods of our land and our ancestors. No, mother. What is your problem? Prince Ugo, you know, now believes in his new choice of religion. Yes. Oh, now I know how the water passed under the bridge. So this is it. Yes. This is it. Mother, mother you, need to, mother, you need to calm down. Mother, please, you just... Change of religion. Just imagine, that is my headache. Oh God. Because when I made reference to that effect, he shut me up, saying that the gods are dead. Fiat man. What nonsense. Hi, you see, God, an elder cannot be in the house while a god delivers in debtors. I will call him to order. 
Just imagine. Hey! You know, if a child is giving advice or directed on what to do and he refuses, when the head is cut off, it falls with the ears. What are you insinuating? All I'm trying to say is one's decision to choice of religion should be respected. You and I know that the king, his majesty, will get your head off your neck if he hears this. I did not discuss anything with you. I'm going. So that is why I had to make Esther come. Ugo, my sister's handing over to her husband will take place in a few days from today. And that can also serve as a day of your marriage. Ugo, I need you to make Esther quickly. Come and take my sister's hand in marriage. Everything will just fall into place simultaneously. <laughs> Prince Afonwa, now I know you are a friend indeed. I, I know you have shown me so much love, though I don't want it. But I have an inch, I don't know. Some itches? Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Ugo, what itches are you talking about? Look, I can join you and fight them. I can join you and fight them if need be. But first of all, we have to break all barriers. We have to break the boundaries. You know the scripture says. Oh, that, there you go again, Prince Ugo. There you go again. I know you are ready to fight or kill someone for my sake. But remember, you cannot kill who you will mourn. Remember? I don't understand. You go make me understand. What, what, what do you mean by I can't kill who you have your mourn? What do you mean by Just that? try to understand me. My father, the king, kicks against my newfound faith in the living God. Oh God. Oh God, take the poor by the arm. The scripture says that one with God is a majority. God is the father of the fatherless. He's the mother of the motherless. He is the brother of the brotherless. My friend, you have to do the needful. The brethren will stand in for you. The Bible says that with God all things are possible. Cheer up, come with me. <laughs> 